guys, it's um, it's Thursday morning, and well, it's not Thursday morning anymore. It's Thursday afternoon. It's two twenty-six p.m. I've been painting since eleven thirty. I've got paint all over me everywhere. Um, so I almost got the cupboards and everything done, and um, I've been on the floor, knelt over, um, or kneeling down and painting on the inside of the cupboards. And my back's really starting to hurt, so I had to take a break. And then when I was sitting here watching a couple art videos, I got hungry. So I decided to take a little break and have some cherries. And um, I'm having some of those pickles that I bought yesterday with the pickled cauliflower and everything in there. Those are really good. Um, there's a cat. Uh, the day is going fairly quickly so far. Um, Jeremy has actually told me that he's off tomorrow because it's a... Um, I guess uh, a holiday for the miners. It's it's King Miner Day here tomorrow, and uh, so he gets to have the day off because where operations are ending, where he's working, they don't need people to go in, and they don't want to pay the double time and a half. So he's actually getting a, a paid day off. So um, we're gonna go and get the moldings and everything to go in the living room and Selena's bedroom tomorrow probably tomorrow morning after we get up and have lunch or breakfast whatever and um, I'm probably I may stop painting the cupboards for the day because I'm really worried about my back at the moment it's really hurting so I think I may stop that but yeah I'm just having a little quick snack here I want to go to Walmart this afternoon to get oh, I just hit myself in the head some stretchy string for this because I want to add a few more inserts on the inside and um, the way that I have it right now I can't because I don't have any stretchy elastic so I'm gonna go and get some of that and uh, possibly look at the other planner stuff that they have there at Walmart to see if there's anything there that would be that would be beneficial to me um, I know I started my little my big journal where I was adding in pictures but I kind of like this like I said for the trip because then I can add things in I really really wish I had like a mini Polaroid camera or something to take pictures along the way or one of those um, um, printers that hook up to your phone and you can just print from your phone and it prints off Polaroids I would really really love to have something like that but unfortunately I can't afford $200 for one of those mini printers at the moment so um, yeah that's that's pretty much it so i'm going to i want to go to walmart if there's not too many people around i'll show you what little bit of stuff they have there for the traveler's notebook or the traveler's journal whichever it is you want to call it um but i'm going to finish eating um possibly um i gotta put the dogs outside grab a shower and then i might head to walmart um and since jeremy's gonna be off tomorrow then he can move the fridge and everything for me then i can get the rest of the cupboards painted and that's it for the painting. Well, I think I'm going to paint the doors as well, but then that's pretty much it for the painting on the inside of the house. And it's raining all week, so I'm not going to get outside painted. So it's got to get done the week after, because the week after that we're leaving. So, I don't know. Um, we'll get it figured out, I guess. But I'm going to go finish snacking on this, finish watching this um, Safira Lou video, and get on with the day. Guys, I am super excited over what I just decided to do. Um... I have been holding on to some birthday money since May, actually the end of April, and I really wasn't sure what I wanted to spend my money on, because when I moved I wanted to get myself a new desk, but I'm going to be building a desk now, so I um, it's probably going to cost about $50 to build it, so I'm not worried, um, but I wanted something to go with my travel journal, and um, for taking pictures, and I was interested in getting an Instax camera, but I kind of walked away from that and got myself an HP sprocket yeah um, so this was bought with my birthday money it went a little bit over my birthday money but not much um, and I did get some inserts for the travel journal that I can use so that'll be all fine and dandy to use with that so I'm super excited to test it out and uh, like I said birthday money not travel money I've been holding on to it since uh, the end of April and uh, so I decided that you know I really like taking these little pictures and I've got this thing to take with me on the trip now so I can you know take pictures along the way print them right away so it's super super um, exciting for me anyway anyway I'm gonna um, kind of clean up here I gotta tie my hair up but it's really hot it's like 30 degrees outside and I'm wearing all this hair down can't happen um, and I'm going to um, set up my printer and test it out and I'll record it and show you guys what I think of it so I have my travel journal set up I have all of these extra ones that I bought just in case I couldn't fit any more than three books in here or two books 
because I have my watercolor paper, so um, it's it's pretty tight. There's this little thing in here I figured would be good for keeping receipts and stuff in, or um, little things that I pick up along the way on the trip. And there's these things that I bought that like stickers and that, that people tend to use in, in travel journals and whatnot, so that's in there. Um, all of these products are by Momenta. Um, not sponsored or anything. Um, I have this one. This is um, like a monthly planner. So I thought that would, I would put that in. It would be good to um, track my you know YouTube videos and, and make notes and things that need to be done. Then I still have that spare um, the just the water uh, white paper um, in the middle for like just sketching on. And then I have my watercolor paper in the back. And then there's another little um, thing right here that's like a, a pouch. And then there's the other half of this uh, folder back here. And it's pretty chunky. Um, I'm, I'm really good with just using the brown pieces for now um, because I think maybe what I'll do is probably decorate them. Um, I don't know how. I, I kind of gave away all of my mixed media stuff when I packed up and everything a while back. But uh, I, I kind of would like to have a piece of material here that's probably slightly a little bit longer on each side so I can fit more in there because I would like to have a line journal in there as well for making notes with and um, I'd also like to stick a few more things in there too so I I mean it's nice and chunky now as it is but I kind of wish that I was able to fit in an, at least one more book of line paper um, but it's I could if I took out my watercolor paper but I kind of want to keep that in there in case I want to do some watercolor stuff on the boat but um, yeah that's where I am so far and now I'm going to go and open up this and uh, see what it's all about. So I'm going to take it out and I put the um, paper inside and it's just a little tiny packet of paper and I have to charge it before I can actually use it. Uh, this is a little piece of paper right here. Um, you can only put 10 pieces in there at a time. Um, that's what I've learned so far, but uh, I'm going to go and download a little app that comes with it now while I'm waiting for it to charge, and uh, hopefully um, we can go from there. But that's what it looks like. It's about the size of my hand, and I like the fact that it's rose gold and, and the white. It looks really nice, so let's just, um, I'm going to download the app and see if um, I need to wait until this thing is fully charged before I can actually print something. All right, guys, so I couldn't really do much showing you what was happening on the screen. That is not supposed to happen. It's, it's spitting out this little piece of paper. I don't think that was supposed to happen. It said to put that in. Maybe it's the first one. I don't know. But it said to put it in face down. So I don't know if I did the right thing or if I did a wrong thing here or what. Um... We'll see what happens, I guess. Hopefully it spits out a picture, because this is not a picture. It's not doing anything. I don't know, I think I messed something up. I'm gonna go and try to print this again, but it did not come out. Oh, there it comes. Oh, that's pretty cool. So it's a picture of Pixie that I printed out and it's uh, it's got a develop and everything there. I hope it looks a little bit better than this. It's kind of... Hopefully it'll take a, a bit of time to develop. Well, it's not that bad, I guess. It, it is neat. Um, and it has... It's a sticker backing too, so hope maybe after it sits for a bit, maybe it'll come in a little bit brighter i don't know but it's not a horrible picture it's it's like um it looks old-fashioned right because it's polaroid so it's uh it's kind of what i'm looking for so it's really neat it's not really for like if i want to get pictures for you know um like a photo album or whatnot then i'll print them off on a regular printer but this is not that bad it's it's kind of cute so i'm gonna go and uh, i've only got nine left so maybe i'll go and try one more for now and see if um a different color comes out a little bit differently uh but i kind of I really, I really like it it's not too bad it's uh it's Friday morning. Jeremy is uh, in the back making sure that the hitch that we just bought for the U-Haul trailer fits. 
it's 30 degrees outside today sun heat not humidity sun heat and uh, I'm baking here Jeremy's truck still doesn't have any air conditioning because that's getting fixed on Monday um, and oh my god it is totally warm outside today I've um, been checking around town to see if I can't find some uh, paper for my uh, for my printer um, until I ordered some on Amazon last night they're not going to get here until later next week um, and I only have seven pictures left and I want to start printing off some stuff and I'm afraid to use them all um, until I get my other ones so um, I'm gonna check shoppers drug mart I know that they used to sell um, instax paper if they're pretty cheap I may get a pack of that paper I know there's um, a frame around it and it's a little bit different than the um, then the, what do you call it, the zinc paper that's in the sprocket, but maybe um, if I put a frame around the pictures that I want to print off, then it'll kind of come out the same. So we'll see, um, see what happens. I don't know, maybe it won't fit. Maybe it won't, you know, because the paper is slightly bigger, so maybe I won't even bother with that. But I'm going to check to see if they have it there anyway, the zinc paper, maybe for like Polaroid or whatever, and, and check on that. But it is so hot. We went to Tim's and got um, a yogurt parfait and a chocolate milk for breakfast because we slept a little bit late today. But right now, we are going to head over to the hardware store to pick up the moldings to go down in the house. And we're going to get that um, as much finished today as we can. And I still have the cupboards left to paint, and uh, so we're going to get at that today as well well provided we don't die from all the heat I'm not complaining about the heat but I am complaining about the heat at the same time so don't tell Jeremy that <laughs> this is super embarrassing to show because of the mess but what am I supposed to do when I have to pack all this crap up everything is taken out of the cupboards right now except for this one over right here because it, it's all cleaned painted except for like way up on the top that has to be done still but these are all the like most of these dishes we're not even taking with us because most of everything that we have to take with us is already packed away and I've got all this stuff on the stove here and I have this covered left down here too um, I'm just working on this I need one more coat of paint down there and I need one more coat of paint over here and in this cupboard right here and uh, then it's all done but what a mess I have what a mess <laughs> <laughs> 